Well, will you feel quit that? basking in pleasure and untie mine, please? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, it feels so good just to be able to move around. Oh, I can't believe I let us get into this mess. You know what? I, ah, I find that little creep up and break him in half. Well, how are we going to find him? We don't know anything about Susan. Oh, don't worry. We'll find him, all right. But we don't have to find him. All we have to do is just find the coat for Scott. It's the only evidence that we have. Otherwise, how are we going to prove that I was framed? We still have the printout sheet, right? I mean, that doesn't do us a lot of good if we can't read the thing. Don't worry. Uh, we have time. We're going to try to break that thing, and we will. See, we should have listened to Martha and gone to Chicago to try to find Tessie. Well, even if we do have the money to go to Chicago, which we don't, how do we know Tessie's going to be there? I don't have all the answers. All I know is Tessie might not even be on our side, and who knows if she's setting us up for another trap or not. Well, what are we going to do now? We're going to go to Al's video parlor. We're going to try to find some stuff out about Martha and this guy wishing, and hopefully get the coat and money back. Okay. It's all right at home. Let's go. Oh. If we forget the printout, honey, we're really... I got it. Let's go. Come on. Chance? I think so. We're looking for a woman named Martha. Who? Yeah, it's this old lady named Martha we were talking to the other day. Do you know her? I don't know. We're also looking for a man named Wishy. He's he's short and he has a mustache. Well, what about him? You know him? Oh, I've seen him around. Uh, well, where? We just sort of need to talk to him. Well, I can't help you. I haven't seen him since he was in here the other day. Do you know where he lives? Sure. You can try any street, any alley. Alley? Look, he stole a lot of money from us, and you could be in a lot of trouble. Sweetheart, excuse us a minute, okay? I don't think it's a good idea that we mention the money in the coat, okay? Why not? Because if I would have been flashing it around the other day, we could still have it. You're right, but I still think we should put pressure on this guy so he can tell us where the coat and the money is. He's probably telling the truth. He probably has no idea where it is. What do we do? Well, then what are we going to do now? I'm starving and we don't have any money. Well, we have a choice. Mm -hmm. We can either hit the streets and try to find things out for ourselves. Or? Or we go to the bus terminal and find out when the next bus for Chicago leaves. Do you think we'll ever find Tessie? Well, who knows? I think Martha's story is legit, though. She said that Tessie's boat was going to get in Chicago three days from then, and that's tomorrow. Briscoe, we don't have any money to buy any tickets to go to Chicago, so what are we going to do? Well, when we find out how much the fare is, then we worry about money. Come on. Video parlor. Hey, you want me to call you if I saw your friends? Right, Al. Are they there? And they just left. I heard them say that they were going to the bus station. Did you didn't tell them that that I was asking about them, right? Oh, didn't say a thing. Great. Well, I really appreciate that, Al. I really do. 